let's see the next question <clears throat> the next question says raj invested 10000 in the fund at the end of the first year he incurred a loss but his balance was more than 5000 this balance when invested in another year grew and the percentage of growth in the second year was five times the percentage in of loss incurred in the first year so in the first year he incurred loss next year is gaining five percentage of the magnitude of loss which he has incurred in the first year if the gain of raj from the initial investment over the two years is 35 percentage then the percentage of loss in the first year is what now if you, if you look at the kind of question which is there this is basically from the topic of percentage and the application on which the question has been based is a module of successive percentage changes where multiple changes are happening together which is given by change of a plus change of b and then change on change now certainly i do not know the value of each of the change the only thing which i know if say the loss is basically x percentage in the first year next year i am incurring a profit of 5x next year i am incurring a profit of 5x percentage so possibly my first value is minus x second value is 5x and then since one is positive one is negative a into b will also be negative so it's basically 5x percentage of x this value should be equal to 35 percentage as what they are telling you that's my first loss this is my second profit and this is profit into loss as the common uh, principle of successive percentage will be applied here now certainly you will just look at the option to see which option can come which can not come for example if you go ahead with 5 uh, then possibly it's going to become minus 5 in the first year plus 25 in the second in the second year and then it's going to become minus 25 percentage of 5 now obviously this expression the whole e value will not come up to 35 percentage so 5 will not be the answer if you look at all the options if you check with the option c which is 10 it's going to become minus 10 plus 5 times 10 which is plus 50 minus 50 percentage of 10 let's see what the value is all about minus 10 plus 50 will give you 40 and then 50 percentage of 10 will give you 5 and the final expression will give you plus 35 percentage in the end so it was one of the simplest question though the length of the question is slightly bigger but as said the length of the question will not decide the complexity of the question smartly by looking at the options you can eliminate the other options really very well and the answer for the given question will be as simple as 10 percentage now 10 is the loss incurred in the first year so it's minus 10